Hello and welcome to all. I am your host, Abraham, presenting the episode's top current affairs. Firstly, we will go to the international sector. BRICS Foreign Ministers Meeting held. BRICS Foreign Ministers Meeting was held on July 25th and July 26th, 2019 in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. The meeting focused on the importance of upholding and supporting the objectives of Financial Action Task Force. During the meeting, the Five Nations called for concerted efforts to fight against terrorism under UN approval on a firm international legal basis. Retired General V.K. Singh who is the Union Minister of State for Road, Transport and Highways, represented India. Before going to the next topic, here are some facts about BRICS. BRICS is an association of five major emerging national economies of the world. Brazil, Russia, India, China, South Africa. Originally, four were grouped in this association. South Africa came into this association in 2010. India-Nepal Logistics Summit organized in Kathmandu. India-Nepal Logistics Summit was organized in Kathmandu, Nepal on 28 July 2019. The summit was inaugurated by the Prime Minister of Nepal, Mr. K.P. Sharma Oli. The theme for the summit was Transforming Logistics Landscape. The participants included the government representatives and trade community from both the countries India and Nepal. Next is the national sector. Fagu Chauhan sworn as Bihar Governor. Fagu Chauhan was sworn in as the 40th Governor of Bihar on July 30th, 2019. He replaced Lalji Tandon, who is appointed as the Governor of Madhya Pradesh. Chauhan is a six-time BJP MLA from Gosi Assembly Constituency in Uttar Pradesh. The oath was administered by Chief Justice of the Patna High Court, Mr. Amreshwar Pradab Sahi. The ceremony had taken place at Raj Bhavan. The Chief Minister of Bihar, Mr. Nidish Kumar and Deputy Chief Minister, Mr. Sushil Kumar Modi were present at the ceremony. GST rate on electronic vehicles reduced. The GST rate on electronic vehicles is reduced from 12% to 5%. The GST rate on charger or charging stations for electronic vehicles was also reduced from 18% to 5%. The reduced rate will be effective from August 1st, 2019. The following changes were made during the GST Council meeting which was held in New Delhi. The Council meeting was held as a video conference under the chairmanship of Union Finance and Corporate Affairs Minister Mrs. Narmala Sridhar Raman. Obituary V. G. Siddhartha on deck. Mr. V. G. Siddhartha, the owner of India's largest cafe chain, Cafe Coffee Day, was found dead near the Netravadi River. He was gone missing on the evening of 29th July 2019. His body was found on 31st July 2019 at the Hockey Bazaar Beach at 6.30 am by a local fisherman. He was the son-in-law of SM Krishna, the former Chief Minister of Karnataka and former Indian Minister for External Affairs. Disney legend Rusi Taylor is no more.
Disney legend Lucy Taylor, an American voice actress, passed away. She was famous for providing the voices of Minnie Mouse and the Simpsons character Martin Prince. Next is the banking section. IBBI sets one year timeline for insolvent companies. The Insolvency and Bankruptcy Board of India has changed the process of liquidation to make it time bound for insolvent companies. The new rules say that the process must be finished within one year of its commencement. The new rules also say that it is a compromise between the stakeholders. The process must happen within 90 days of the liquidation order. Next is appointments. S.V. Ranganath as Cafe Coffee Days Interim Chairman. Following the tragic demise of Cafe Coffee Day founder V.G. Siddhartha, S.V. Ranganath was appointed as the Interim Chairman of Coffee Day Enterprise. V.K. Johri appointed as new BSF Director General. Research and Analysis Wing Officer V.K. Johri was appointed as the next Director General of Border Security Force. The order has been issued by the Appointments Committee of the Cabinet that is headed by Prime Minister of India Narendra Modi and has Home Minister Amit Shah as his member. Last Sports Section The ICC World Test Championship to begin on August 1st. The ICC World Test Championship will start from 1st August 2019 with the beginning of the Ashes series played between Australia and England. The final of the World Test Championship will be played at Lords in England in June 2021. In this tournament, the participating members are Australia, Bangladesh, England, India, New Zealand, Pakistan, South Africa, Sri Lanka and West Indies. And that's all for now. This is your host Abraham signing off. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to subscribe, like and share.